We say the day they killed my son, I also died with him. Nicole Vasquez describes her son Isaiah as caring, dedicated, and more than anything, a family man. He likes spending time with his siblings. He was so happy to be a dad. But Isaiah never got to be a dad. On March 12th, he was shot and killed while picking up a friend. His girlfriend, then seven months pregnant, was there by his side as he took his last breath. It hurts a lot, too. He never got to meet his son. And my grandson's never going to know his dad. 18-year-old Omar Tafoya Hernandez was arrested and charged for second-degree homicide shortly after. He's still awaiting trial. It says, I believe there's two kids who lost their lives. My son lost his life and so did the other boy and destroyed two families. Gun violence is one of the leading causes of death in the U.S. And the CDC reports more teens have died to gun violence this year than anything else. Nicole hopes her kid's life and death becomes more than a statistic. That's why she hopes to speak in local schools and teach kids and teens about the dangers of gun violence and hopefully prevent other parents from ever feeling her pain. It's not worth it. They just destroyed two families. Two boys lost their lives. And um, my grandson, you know, he's proof that this is real. This is real and it needs to stop. And while tragic, she says she believes everything happens for a reason and hopes by spreading this message, at least one life will be saved by will be saved from gun violence. Reporting in Flagstaff, Mason Carroll for Arizona's Family.